I just thought I'd make a quick video to show you um, document versioning, uh, which is a new feature in Lion, and I think an incredibly powerful feature, um, although it's not entirely clear how to actually utilize it and get to it, I don't think. Um, but anyway, I shall show you. Now, we've had file versioning of a kind um, for a couple of years uh, in Snow Leopard uh, and Leopard with Time Machine, um, but that only makes backups every hour or so, so that's not really all that great if you're working on um, a document full time, um, which is where this different versioning system comes in. So let me open up this uh, document I've got here that I wrote in Pages, and here we are, that was my first revision, my second revision, and so forth. As you can see, it's a, obviously a highly intellectual opus, what I've written so far, and it's going to be fantastic. Millions will read it, it's going to be better than Harry Potter and other rubbish like that. Anyway, um, if I go to the File menu, uh, I can save a version, I can duplicate this, I can revert to saved, uh, or I can export. Um, now the actual right answer is revert to saved, but uh, the thing is that to me, having used a computer for a number of years, revert to saved means something different. It does not mean go back to different versions uh, or browse existing versions. It means that I've made a few changes here and I want to revert back to the last saved version. Um, so I think Apple really need to clear that up. But another way you can do it is that actually if you go up here to the document title um, and we click on the little arrow, do you see that subtly appearing and disappearing? Um, and we can go to Browse All Versions. And I click on that. And here we go, going back in time. It's much like Time Machine, the interface. Uh, as you can see, I've got time going back here and so forth. Um, so if I go back to my earliest revision, there we go. And I could click Restore at this point, and that is then how my version would end up looking uh, like. But um, there's a very useful additional feature in that these documents are actually edit editable, these previous versions. Uh, so let's imagine I had a paragraph of text um, at some point in the past in my document, and I actually took it out. Um, and I now get way down the line, I've been doing all my revisions, uh, but I want to put that paragraph back in. Well, you don't need to restore back to a previous version to actually uh, get it, because obviously you would then lose all your subsequent revisions that you do want to keep. So what you do is you can just go into a previous version, you can copy, and you can go across to your current version, and you can paste, and you can say done. And there we go. So there is a bit from one of my previous versions chucked in with all my subsequent revisions um, to the document. Uh, and I can now save a version of that. There we are. Um, and I can also, if I click on revert to saved, it will actually give me this option. But as I said before, I don't think it's terribly well labelled. I think it should be browse previous versions or something like that in the file menu. So anyway, there you go, versions. Very powerful feature. Sadly, a little bit too hidden away for my liking for most users, I would have thought. But anyway, there you go.